Hello friends, this is Adam with Movie Guy 365. It is a new release week for Blu-ray and 4K Ultra HD. So here's what's coming out online and in stores for May 7th, 2024. Don't forget to use the Amazon affiliate link in the comments section if you're interested in any of these titles. The big release this Tuesday will be the 4K of The Crow. It will get a standard slipcover edition as well as a non-exclusive steelbook. Both are expected to be in stores and of course online. Over at Walmart, they will have an exclusive Steelbook edition, which is expected to be at that retailer this Tuesday and available for shipping on their website. Out on 4K this week is from Francis Ford Coppola, One from the Heart, Reprise. It will be available at online retailers. Coming from Shout Factory is the 4K release of the animated films The Addams Family 1 and 2, which are available for the first time on physical 4K. Out this week from Cult Epics, the 1998 film Frivolous Lola, which is getting both a Blu-ray and a 4K release. WB Archive has some titles coming out on Tuesday. The Blu-ray release of Scooby-Doo on Zombie Island and Return to Zombie Island. And Boris Karloff stars in the adventure film The Mask of Fu Manchu. From director Anthony Mann, the 1950 western Devil's Doorway. And James Caan stars in the 1969 drama The Rain People. Mill Creek Entertainment has the double feature director spotlight, Sidney Pollock, and from 2024, the comedy, A Most Atrocious Thing. And the 2016 horror film, We Go On, gets a Blu-ray. MVD has some titles coming out this week. First up, the comedy, Joysticks, gets a release, and the Star Wars spoof, Hardware Wars, is also available on Blu-ray. And the film, Sabotage, is getting a release from MVD. The 1972 horror film, Dr. Jekyll and the Werewolf, is out, and Seeing Red 3, French Vigilante Thrillers, three films from 1982 to 1984. And Zero Woman, Red Handcuffs, the 1974 action drama, will be available. Last week, Severin's 4K releases of both films The Church and The Sect came out. Well, this Tuesday, it's the Blu-ray's turn. These are both going to be available on May 7th. She is Conan from 2023 is getting a release. And the most truthful advertising film I've probably seen in a long time the 2023 horror comedy Bad CGI Gator will be available. A Blu-ray release of the 1997 musical comedy Too Much Sleep and Rising Sun Media has the horror film Kachanika. The sci-fi horror film Shadow Zone will be available on Blu-ray and the thriller Breaking Her Will will be out Tuesday. The 2023 documentary Kim's Video is getting a Blu-ray release. Coming Tuesday from Arrow Video, the 1996 drama Night Falls on Manhattan starring Andy Garcia. Coming this Tuesday from Kino Lorber, the Blu-ray and 4K of the 1952 Western High Noon starring Gary Cooper and Grace Kelly. Originally scheduled for release about a week or two ago, it got a last minute delay. Well, this Tuesday, May 7th, we'll finally see the Blu-ray editions of both Fletch and Fletch Lives starring Chevy Chase. And from director Fritz Lang, 1947's Secret Beyond the Door is getting a Blu-ray. On the TV Blu-ray front this week, Kino Lorber will have season six of Monk. And finally this Tuesday, a single release from the Criterion Collection. And as a reminder, most Criterion titles can be picked up locally at Barnes & Noble and, of course, various online retailers. The double feature, A Story of Floating Weeds and Floating Weeds from 1934 and 1959 will be out this Tuesday from Criterion. As for my own pickups this week, I went with the Walmart exclusive steelbook of The Crow, which actually arrived over the weekend, and I'm going to be posting a full review this Tuesday. I was a little undecided which version to go for. I honestly like the artwork on the standard slip as well as the non-exclusive steelbook, but the Walmart one ultimately won out. And Francis Ford Coppola's One from the Heart, I'll be excited to check that one out now that it's been given a 4K bump. And of course, I'm definitely in for Kino Lorber's High Noon. I'm a huge fan of classic westerns, and Kino is pretty good with their transfers, so I'll be posting a review for that in the coming days. So that is everything coming to both Blu-ray and 4K for the week of May 7th, 2024. Don't forget to use the Amazon affiliate link in the comments section. It really helps out the channel when you do. But now I want to hear from you. What movies on Blu-ray or 4K are you planning to pick up this week? And finally, a special thank you to my patrons for your continued support. If you would like to support me through Patreon, I will leave a link in the description of this video. So until next time, this is Adam with Movie Guy 365. I will see you at the movies.